Okay, so let's look at question number 17, part A of the Combined Mathematics 2024 A-level paper. So this is trigonometric question. Right. So we are given first, we want to express 6 cos 2x minus 8 sin 2x is in the form R cos 2x plus alpha form. Right. So then this is what so 6 cos 2x minus 8 sin 2x has to be equal to r cos 2x plus alpha form so r we can find by using what using 6 and 8 so 6 squared plus 8 squared and take the square root of that 6 squared plus 8 squared square root of that so 10 r is 10 right then alpha is going to be what alpha is going to be so if we write this down take 10 out so we'll get what 6 over 10 or no, 3 over 5 cos 2x minus 4 over 5 sine 2x so then this has what 10 cos 2x plus alpha form so then from here we know cos alpha is 3 over 5 and sin alpha is 4 over 5 right so we can say r is 10 and alpha is what cos inverse 3 over 5 or sin inverse 4 over 5 right okay so that part is done okay so we did that now next what hence solve this trigonometric equation so we'll do that 6 cos 2x minus 8 sin 2x is equal to 5 and this part we know is equal to 10 cos 2x plus alpha equals 5 where alpha is equal to cos inverse 3 over 5 right so then cos 2x plus alpha is equal to half so that is cos uh, pi over 3 then 2x plus alpha is equal to uh, uh, 2n pi plus or minus pi over 3 then 2x is equal to 2n pi plus or minus pi over 3 minus alpha then x is equal to n pi plus or minus pi over 6 minus alpha over 2 n belongs to z and alpha is what alpha is equal to cos inverse 3 over 5 so that is the solution for this trigonometric equation all right so then what do we need right then express 24 cos squared minus 32 sin x cos 6 in this form so we'll do that next 24 cos squared x minus 32 sin x cos 6 so this turns into what? This turns into uh, 16 sin 2x. So this one cos squared x we can write as what? 12 times 2 cos squared x minus 16 sin 2x. This is equal to what? 1 plus cos 2x. So then this turns into what 
12 plus 12 cos 2x minus 16 sin 2x so 24 cos squared x minus 32 sin x cos x is equal to 12 cos 2x minus 16 sin 2x plus 12 right so that part is done last part is what deduce the minimum value of 24 cos squared x minus 32 sin 2 sin x cos x so this expression so we'll use the expression we just created to find the minimum value of because both expressions are the same so we need to find the minimum value of we need to find minimum value of this so let's write that down 12 cos 2x minus 16 sine 2x plus 12 so notice if i take a 2 out of the first two terms i get 6 cos 2x minus 8 sine 2x plus 12 and there's an expression we found for this that is what 10 cos 2x plus alpha where alpha was cos inverse of 3 over 5 so this becomes what 20 cos 2x plus alpha plus 12 right we want to find the minimum value of this so it 12 doesn't change no that is constant so what changes is the first term so what is the minimum value that the first term can take so we know cost terms cost values are between plus one and minus one so the minimum value this term can take is what minus 20 so then minimum value this expression can take is what minus 20 plus 12 so minus 8 is the minimum value right so that is the part a of question number 17 next we will do part b